Hey guys, Drew here, and I'm playing some Search and Destroy on Marvel for 3. Uh, this is a pretty old gameplay, actually. I go 14 and 1 on Hardhat, which is the only map I get gameplay on. This is in, uh, um, Village. No, Mission. Mission. God dang it, dude. I suck at maps. Anyways, uh, so yeah, 14 1, pretty good score, at least for me. Uh, and the kids in this game were being douchebags. They were doing the Recon Pro flashing from the spawn bullshit. Uh, but I was playing this game with Jack, like I said, it was a while ago, but, uh, my friend Jack, he was in X-Gen with me, so I'll go ahead and link him in the description, I guess, I don't know why, just, just cause Jack's Jack, I love Jack, um, but yeah, he posts some cool Search and Destroy clips and random stuff like that, so go check him out if you want, anyways, and so, I was watching this Jimmy Tatro video today, actually yesterday, no, well, it was at, it was at 12 o'clock last night, so, Today, I guess, technically, but anyways, I was watching this Jimmy Tatro video. Um, I guess you guys don't even know who Jimmy Tatro is, which is kind of surprising. Um, so, real quick, Jimmy Tatro is everything that I love about YouTube. Um, but for real, he's probably my favorite YouTuber. He's not a commentator, he's a fucking bro that does bro videos. Like a bro. Um, but he's probably my favorite YouTuber. Like, if he were to not post videos anymore, I'd probably just quit my life. Rage quit my life and go do some. I don't know. But uh, I'll leave a link to that video in the description as well, the video that inspired me, because he did a video about how, because I live in Los Angeles, or the suburbs of LA, yeah, and for those of you who watch hockey or pay attention to any of that, the Kings, LA Kings just won the Stanley Cup, and so he did a video about how everyone in LA is just kind of hopping on the bandwagon now, because in Los Angeles, hockey is very, very much not the most popular sport, it's probably the least popular uh, besides the WNBA, because that shit's a joke. Uh, sorry if there's any girls watching this channel, but fucking seriously, dude, WNBA is terrible. Um, so anyways, uh, yeah, it goes like Lakers, Dodgers, Clippers, maybe Dodgers and Clippers are, Lakers are the number one team, though, fuck, fuck anyone who disagrees with that. Lakers, Clippers, Dodgers, Kings, I don't even know what the hell a WNBA team is. Uh, I think it's like the Sparks, the Sparkles, I don't know. Anyways, totally getting off topic. So he made a video about how everyone bandwagons onto the Kings uh, now that they're doing well and everything. And I'll kind of admit, like, see, here's what I don't understand uh, about bandwagoning. Is I feel like there's kind of a fine line. Like, for me, I'm, I've am i always been a fan of Lakers. I've always been a fan of Kobe. Now, whenever I tell someone that, they're like, oh, you're just jumping on the bandwagon. Well, it's like, no, I've liked the Lakers and I've liked Kobe since I was four and watching basketball. So, suck my dick. Um... And it just, it bugs me that people jump to those conclusions so, so, uh, what's the word? So just quickly, I guess. That was a terrible word to use. Um, so, anyways, about being, uh, bandwagoning for the Kings, I guess. Uh, I, I don't feel like I bandwagon for them, but, like, it's like, I live in LA. Obviously, I'm gonna root for them. Like, I'm gonna go root for the kings i don't feel like that's bandwagoning you know like i'm not gonna go sit here and say like oh yeah i've liked the kings my whole life dude i've been hardcore kings fan love that goalie quick it's beast like i'm not gonna do that but i'm gonna i'm gonna fucking root for my home team like why wouldn't i you know like i don't, I don't think there's anything wrong with that um now it's the same thing now here's actually what i wanted to ask you guys so i like duke i've always liked duke but the reason I started liking them is pretty lame. So, uh, Duke is a college, for anyone who didn't know that. Uh, and their mascot is the Blue Devils. Now, when I was three years old, I was watching, I think it was a Duke lacrosse game or some shit like that. No, it was field hockey. It was field hockey. And their mascot's the Blue Devils. And I immediately said, oh, I love Blue Devils. That's so cool. That's such a cool name. And from there on out, I have liked Duke. And I've followed them. And I've watched all their basketball games. And I love their basketball team now. Now, I don't really know how that works, because I don't really feel like I bandwagon that, because I was three years old, and the reason I started liking Duke is for their mascot, but I've liked Duke for for so long now, and, uh, you know, I was only three when I found out that their mascot was the Blue Devils, so I mean, you, I, I don't know, man, I don't really feel like there's a problem with that, so, I don't know, I guess what I'm trying to get at is that I feel like bandwagoning, bandwagoning, I don't, I don't know how to say that as a word, like, that's a really hard word to say, but... I feel like the whole thing, just in general, is kind of a, I don't know, it's kind of a stupid thing. Now, obviously there's some people who hardcore ride their dicks as soon as they start doing well, uh, and I feel like the, like, I give everyone shit who likes the heat, no matter what, like, I don't even give them a chance, I, so I guess I'm a little bit of a hypocrite here, 
because anyone who likes LeBron James or the Heat, like, I just say, oh, yeah, hop on the bandwagon more, because uh, I'm a douchebag, <laughs> no one likes me, uh, so, I give anyone shit who likes the Heat, because if you like the Heat, then, you know, go fuck yourself, unless you're subscribed to me, in which case, you know, I love you, because you're subscribed to me, and we're just, we're, we're butt buddies, but, uh, I just feel like, I don't know, I don't feel like people like the Heat just because they're popular, I just don't like how that whole thing turned out and if you don't know i mean i'm i don't have enough time in this video to explain it but just the whole thing with heat just fucking bugs the shit out of me like when lebron james with cleveland you know i could care less the dude's a pretty good player and i still think he's a good player i just don't have much respect for him um so whatever anyways that's just kind of my thoughts on it i don't know um i've been playing a lot of pc lately just to totally change topics on you guys sorry about that actually to totally change topics again <laughs> uh i'm eating these ruffles baked cheddar loaded potato skins i don't know what they're called but they're sitting in front of me and i was about to eat some that's why i brought it up um and they're really good but yeah back on to my other off topic thing i've been playing a lot of pc games and i wanted to know if you guys would be in to see some counter-strike some counter-strike source gameplay because i used to play that game a lot when i was um a little bit younger and now that i'm a tad bit better at pc i'd like to say i think i'd be a little bit better i think it'd be nice to play a game like counter-strike where i didn't get my shit pushed in every game i played because you know people who play counter-strike still like counter-strike stores still and 1.6 like they're fucking good it's the same with pro mod dude people who play card for pro mod have never left the scene and they just push my shit in it's retarded like i get scope and people just laugh at me because of how bad i am but you know it's it's no big deal i, I brush that shit off and i get my clips um, so, I don't know, is that something you guys would want to see on my channel, is a little bit of Counter-Strike, maybe some more pro mod, I don't know, let me know in the comments, all, all there for you, I don't know what that was supposed to mean, but yeah, also let me know about the fanboying bandwagon bullshit, and yeah, I've already talked past what I thought this video was going to go by, so I might have to like, slow down a part or so. I don't even know, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed, leave me a like if you felt necessary, subscribe to me, check the links in the description because they are awesome, and yeah, that's it.